it's always fixed we have this uh, Sony KDL dash 60 W 610 B 60 inch TV so when we push the power button it show green then it start blinking one two three four five six one two three four five six so with the six blinks if we go here to the six blinks so we have likely the main board power supply LCD check on and LVDS the main board is two parts this is the main board and this is the signal board this is the check on board and this is the power board so as we see the six blinking it could be anything could be the main board could be the power supply board the lcd panel the check on board or uh, lvds the tuner board uh, board that's what the signal board is the tuner board the one is here so of the first i plug the tv to the power and let's you see that uh, brownish spot over there is mean the that spot it was like overheat so let's turn on the multimeter so we have about 50 volt over there and we have zero volt here So 50 volt, 0 volt, 33 volt, that's one over there, 35 volt, this one here, 12 volt, 89, 89 volt, uh, let me check. I'm gonna flip the board and look at it. So, this is the other side of the power board. And this is the, the spot that was brown. And if you look at the connectors over there, it's like there is a there is a crack around it. Let's see if we can. Yeah, that's that's a crack in that pen. Some cracks in these pens. So first, let's solder that part and see if that's going to fix the issue. So let's uh, try to turn it on. Oh, you can see the backlight. Then it goes off. It start blinking again. So still there is uh, some issues. Could be the backlight. I'm going to test it now and see because maybe what this MOSFET was getting bad. That's why the backlight is. Burn it. Okay. So we're going to test the backlight. So we're going to go on the top part.
what we can see is go up to the 71 volt and we have the the light here and we have the light over there so we go to the next one let's go again to the 72 volt and we have the light here okay we go to the next one the number three this one this one is just stay at the 13 volt but we have no LEDs light in the here so we go to the number four so number four it's go to the 53 volt and we have the backlight here So the one is number three, that's the problem is. So we're going to put this LED testers. So in this one we have one is, is off. This one it has a two, it has one off. This one here. This one it has two off. This one it has three off. This one it has two, three. This is one, two. This is one. Here is one. This one is nothing, it doesn't work. Yep, this one it doesn't work. This one it doesn't work. This one here it doesn't work. This is there is just four on and two four and four off. This is here is just two on. Here is like about three off. And here is two off. So there is a lot of bad LEDs in this one. I received the backlight for that uh, Sony TV. So this is the backlight. So it's going to be A, B, and we go like that. So we we'll start with the A. Let me push the power button. And we get the backlight on. All the LEDs is on. No dead the LED. So I'm gonna put the screens and uh, see how it's gonna look. The LEDs is going to be A, B, A, B, A, B, 
then AB and here in the middle we start again these two BB close to each other let me show you here you can see them so we start here at the A the first one is the A and the last one is the A and you can see these white clips second part is going to be this uh, and these two black plastics so you put the two sides first this side and that side then you will put this one So after you put the, the plastic, the black uh, plastic bars, we put these films in the top. So then we're gonna put the screen. See, be sure that the screen fits all the way. It's not sticking up. You can see it here and here is moving free up and down if you put it over this one and you try to push it you may crack the corners so be sure all the four corners right in the edge of it and it's moving free then you put this uh, the panel board you put it inside that one so let's test it Ready plug the yeah we have the display yep it looks good so next we're gonna put the bars that's holding the screen after we put the these metal bars and put the speakers the two speakers right and left and put the stand metal we're gonna put the other part to uh, the back cover and uh, this TV should be ready Alright, yes, yeah, looks good. For any LED TV, better you get the the backlight down. Option. Then we go to the backlight. You can see it's set up on max. That's not the right. So it should be like hell for less. That's all for this video. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and see you next one.